Hey everyone, today I'm diving into the fascinating world of the camera obscura and how it shaped art history. First off, what is a camera obscura? Well, it's an ancient optical device that projects an image of its surroundings onto a screen. Imagine a dark room with a small hole on one side. Light passes through the hole and voila! An inverted image of the outside scene appears on the opposite wall. It's like nature's own projector. The concept of camera obscura dates back to ancient China and Greece. Philosophers like Mosey and Aristotle noticed this optical phenomenon long before lenses were invented. Fast forward to the Renaissance and artists began to harness this tool to achieve stunning realism in their work. How does camera obscura work? Light from a scene passes through a small aperture or hole and projects an inverted image on the opposite surface inside a dark chamber. This simple yet ingenious mechanism laid the groundwork for modern photography. Artists like Leonardo da Vinci and Johannes Vermeer utilize camera obscura to enhance their paintings. Vermeer known for his meticulous detail and light effects, likely used this technology to capture lifelike proportions and perspectives in masterpieces like The Girl with a Pearl Earring. It's believed that he traced the camera obscura image in order to achieve such precise detail. Canaletto, the Venetian artist, famous for detailed cityscapes, he used camera obscura to sketch intricate architectural details before painting them. This technique allowed him to create more accurate and intricate paintings of Venice's iconic canals and buildings. But camera obscura wasn't just for the big names. Many artists of the time, both known and unknown, used this device to study light, shadow, and perspective. It was a game changer in the art world, providing a new way to see and capture reality. So, why does this matter today? Understanding Camera Obscura gives us a deeper appreciation for these classic artworks and the innovative techniques artists used long before digital cameras and Photoshop. Plus, it reminds us that technology and art have always been intertwined driving creativity forward. If you found this dive into art history interesting, don't forget subscribe and please consider buying me a coffee. Link in the description and leave a comment below. I'd love to hear your thoughts on Camera Obscura and its impact on art. Thanks for watching and until next time, keep exploring the wonders of history.